Hey guys, welcome back to Mohaws and More. I'm sorry about this view. It's not the best. It's pretty bad, but we got a Dollar Tree haul, okay? So that's what we're going to jump into, and I'm going to show you some things that I saw. This month has been really hard. Um, I hurt my back twice this month. I've been out with that, and I had been really sick. So it's been a really bad month. I haven't been to Dollar Tree at all so i'm feeling better and i went today and i went to one dollar tree and got all these items at the dollar tree it was like 25 items um so uh yeah i'm really really pleased with everything and uh it was really fun to go i miss going so much and i'm glad that i walked out with a bunch of items so yeah um just gonna jump in. I get a lot of food items at Dollar Tree. I love getting the food. Love. So first thing I'm gonna show you guys are some dog treats that I picked up. These are canine carryouts, bacon flavor. I have hauled these before. I don't know if this is what he's smelling, but he's like trying to get into this bag. So um, yeah, just have to stock up on treats all the time. And I found these Sunkiss Breakfast Cranberry um, Orange Biscuits. And you get five in here. And these are really good. I've had them before. So I picked up the Cranberry Orange. I like that one. And they did have the Breakfast Coconut. I don't know if I've had this one before. I think I might have. I'm not sure. But uh, yeah, I got two of these. I did pick up some Eat Regal Spanish Rice. I've not had the Spanish Rice before, but it looks pretty good. So I just picked up one of these to put in the kitchen. And then I did pick up one of the Fiera Spicy Nacho Chips here. I think I'm going to really like these. So... I decided to pick up these, give them a try, whatever. Uh, next, I picked up this yogurt cup. Now, I picked up one of these before. I absolutely love this. This thing is really awesome. I only had one, and I needed to get another one to have for the boyfriend packing his lunches and things like that so I can make him a little yogurt parfait. Um, it just twists off, and you can put all your granola in the top here. And it comes with a spoon as well, so you don't have to pack a spoon in the lunch. There's a spoon in there for you, so very, very simple. It just kind of pops out, and you have your spoon. Wow, a whole put together. There you go. You have a spoon. Done. Done deal. I feel like that could break easily so be careful be careful with your spoons <laughs> that might break easily my other one didn't come with a spoon because someone stole the spoon so whatever but um i'm glad that i picked up another one to have and they had different colors but um i picked that like orange color uh next i picked up this nail polish applicator looks just like this now, in my last video, I mentioned Vivian Tries. If you haven't seen her, go watch her. She does a lot of, like, testing of Dollar Tree items and things like that. And she'll tell you, like, go get it. It's good. It's amazing. So, she made me go get this. And uh, I don't know. I'm going to try it to see. Just said it's supposed to, like, you're supposed to, you know, you put your nail polish. It's just, she just said, like, I don't know, it's just supposed to make it like easier to hold while painting your nails, so. I don't know, I'll give it a try, see how it goes. Might be the best thing ever, but I have one. <laughs> uh, I needed some soap, so I've been really wanting to find the Dove Pink with Deep Moisture. So I picked up one of these, and then I also picked up the Cool Moisture Cucumber Green Tea Scent to have as well. I found some Jot scissors and I picked them up because they were pink. So yeah, I need another set for the kitchen. So I just grabbed the pink, obviously. I found this mask, it's Freeman. 
Cosmetic Metallic Peel-Off Mask. And it's in a soothing rose gold color. And I was like, ooh, okay, yeah, let's just give this a try. It says on the back of this, boost your aurora and get glowing with this precious metals inspired metallic peel off mask. This metallic rose gold mask infused with calendula, calendula extract helps soothe and calm your skin for a healthy looking complexion. Perfect for sensitive skin, which I have very sensitive skin. Um, I don't know. Apply an even layer to clean, dry face, avoiding eyes, eyebrows, hairline, and lips. Leave on for 10 to 15 minutes um, until dry, and then, then gently peel off mask from the outer edges. Edges. Rinse your warm or rinse with warm water. Use twice a week or as often needed. So I'm really, really curious about this. Like I really want to like try this. I'm going to try it tonight. I'm going to just kind of put a little bit on. Ooh. What do you guys think? Let me know if you've tried this. But. Ooh, I like the smell of that. It smells really florally. It's pretty. It's like a nice pretty smell. Yeah. I don't know. I'm going to give this a try tonight. Why not? See if I love it. But yeah, they have all the school supplies out. And I'm like, why don't I have a child yet? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> kidding. Not yet. Um, but seriously, some cute things. Some definitely cute things. I had to buy these because I just, I am putting this in my child's stock bin. If I have a girl, this, this is adorable. These are called Adore Six Push Pencils. Look at these. You get peaches, avocados, and rainbows. Just little pencils. Like, I remember these as a kid. These little push-up pencils. Um, very, very cute. So, is that a... I can't tell if that's an eraser up top or not. I don't know. I can't tell if that's just the cap or an eraser, but these are going in the bin just to have because they're just so stinking cute. Like I can't just not get them. I just can't. This was also so cute. They had a bunch of new keychains also. I was like, wow, cool. Um, these are called Chatty's keychains. And um, I grabbed this cute one. It's just a little teddy bear. And it has like stars inside of it. And I just thought it was really, really cute. So I picked up this one. They had a bunch of different things going on. Um, yeah, I don't even know. But like, I was like, I'm getting at least the teddy bear one. Like, seriously? Seriously, okay. Um, I did need some more facial wipes. So I picked up these. These are called Pick Up and Go Fruity Facial Cleansing Wipes. Um, they're in the orange, which I'm sure are. these are going to be really nice. 25 wipes. So yeah, I got a pack of those. And then I also picked up these by Bolero. I love Bolero wipes. They have, um, these are called the Cleanse and Glow Pink Pineapple and Grapefruit. You get 32 in here. Their packaging is always so fun and just so cool. So I've been trying to find some solar steak lights. Um, and there's ones that I've seen, but um, they're gone. So I'm kind of stuck with these, which I think they're still cool. Um, I'm going to give them a try. They look like this. I'm just going to put them out in the backyard and um yeah i got two so i don't know we'll see so all right so this one pretty quickly the last thing i found here are these three amigos elote mexican street corn snack mix um these look really really good i'm gonna give it a try um I got two bags, so I feel like I'm really gonna like this. You get honey roasted sesame chips, 
um, corn sticks, fiery hot corn chorizos, corn jacks, double cheese corn nuts. So, let's see. Let's see. I don't know why I feel like I'm going to like these. Mm, okay, not bad. I'm just kind of taking handfuls here. Wow, definitely have water nearby or a drink. I'm already thirsty. Um, I like the corn nuts in this a lot. I'm a huge fan of corn nuts, but here's a sesame chip. Okay. I mean, I'll have no problem finishing this bag, but definitely need some water. But anyways, guys, that was the last of this haul. Um, I'm definitely going to add in another clip probably because I'm not done. Hey guys, see, I told you I was going to be back with another Dollar Tree haul. I told you guys I was going to be back. Like, boom, right away. I went and then I'm back again. Like, I had to go back, so I got a haul. I do. And uh, we're gonna jump in. So I mentioned before that I like hauling things for future children for me. Boy, girl. If I have a boy, he's gonna be all about the Hot Wheels. If I have a girl, all about the Barbies. Well, I went a little crazy on Hot Wheels today. So let's show you. Now, these, some of them are Hot Wheels and some are these other things called Turbo Wheels, which I was like, what? These are cool. I'm going to get these too. So, there's two pieces and um, it's police. So, you get the police car and you get this little, I don't know what this is really. I think it's just my, more storage or something. And it attaches onto the police car. And I thought that was adorable so I got this because that's pretty cool like like that's really cool so there was like three different ones of those this one's construction so again you can attach it onto the truck so I thought that was pretty cool the third one to that is the fire truck so that's what that one looks like so for a dollar twenty-five some nice toys to play with like I love I'm all about the cars I used to love playing cars with my brother and it was just a, a fun time with like the the mat where it has all the roads like that was awesome I love that I mean I I would do that right now at my age like totally found this this is by Matchbox and it's a Jeep and I thought it looked pretty cool the sun is now shining in my grill <laughs> All right, so I just moved because of the sun. Um, I found this Jeep. The sun's still kind of shining. That's just how it is. It's just how it is with the sun. Anyways, there's this one with the Jeep. So yeah, I got that. I thought that was pretty cool too. This one is called a Lucid Air and this one is new for 2022. Um, it says HW Green Speed. So I found this one. And then I found a Ford Focus RS. And this is a HW Hatchback. And I had to get it because I drive a hatchback. And hatchbacks are awesome. So I had to get this one. Then I found this. This is a Ford Mustang Match. E1400 and um, yeah 2022 this is a 2020 Jaguar F type I'm all about the cool looking cars for sure and then this one I got new for 2020 a BMW R9T racer 
retro racers. I thought it was pretty cool looking. So I had to get one of those as well. But I'm all about this kind of stuff. This stuff is very fun. I love I love cars. I'm a huge car person. So um, I love looking at this kind of stuff. So moving into some other fun things. Um, I grabbed another one of these peach iced tea Weilers light little drinks to go packs. My favorite one right here. I drink this a lot. I picked up these uh, all clear electronic wipes. They are lemon scented. Never tried these before. My boyfriend's like, can you pick up some electronic wipes? So I was like, yes. So I picked just these up, lemon scented, whatever. We'll give them a, a try. Um, and then I did need a new beauty blender. Um, so I got this one by Sassy and Chic. It's just a black, black one. And then they have these as well. This is by Sassy and Chic and it's a makeup blender sponge. And I like how it has a handle and I was looking for one with the flat top, so I found one. They had different ones. So, yeah, I'm going to give this a try as well. So, I got my two sponges. I did pick up this Essentials Organizer with lid. You just get three slots. Don't know. I'm going to give it a try. I just thought that looks nice to store some things. So, pick it up. All right, so I found some new things. I walked down the kitchen aisle, and I don't go down the kitchen aisle a whole lot because I'm like, I don't need really anything in the kitchen aisle. Nothing really catches my eye when I go in the kitchen aisle. So I saw these towels, okay? Some towels. And I was like, no way. So, let me show you. This is by Stitch and Weft. 100% natural cotton. Never seen these before at Dollar Tree. They didn't have like a price tag what they were. These are distributed by Home Essentials, New York. Um, yeah, I, I don't know, but here we go. This is what it looks like. It says, bless your heart. And it's like these nice, like thick, like nice thick towel. And you get two of them. And this one says, hello, darling. And I was like, what? These are nice for $1.25. Okay. Here's what the, the tag looks like. I was like, okay, seriously, that is, that is nice. It looks like Ray Dunn, kind of, I think. But you get two towels. So these were going really fast. <laughs> People were grabbing them. Um, and then I found this one, Stitch and Weft. This says, this is my happy place. And this one is a different feeling, but it still feels really nice. I like the feeling of it. Um, so there's this one and then it says no place like home on this side. So, um, yeah, go to Dollar Tree if you need some towels, try to find these. I was shocked. I was shocked when I saw these. I was like, they also had one more and it had different like prints on it. It had like a, I don't even know what, what it was, but it was like some kind of print and it was like blue and I, I didn't really like the print, but oh yeah, go, go get you some towels. Okay. Um, I don't, I don't know. These are called Mirabella skinny. Um, these are for your boots. See, here's a picture. You can put them around your boot. Um, the skinny is the Mirabella base layer. You can stack them, flip them, fold them, or wear them under your favorite big guy. 
which means like these big like Ugg boots, you can put them over those. Um, rack them solo or style them to the maximum cap capacity any way you wear them. You are bound to have fun. Um, so I picked this up just because I liked a whole bunch of different patterns. The price tag fell off of this, but guess how much this was? This was $16.50. It's crazy to me. Two sets of stickers that I just picked up at Crafter Square. Um, this is just a 16 count paper crafts pop up. I collect stickers, so I thought these were kind of cool. I really like this one here. So, yeah, grabbed that. And then uh, here are the other ones. All gold, and I really like the lips. So, yeah, just some more collection stickers. And then in my haul, like right before this, those pencils, um, they had matching sticky notes as well. So, I just picked up little sticky notes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight. You get eight of them. So that's pretty cool. So yeah, got those. And um, and then I just picked up this Duncan Hines Perfectly Moist Swiss Chocolate Cake. I like to have some kind of sweet treats in my cabinet at all times as much as possible. You never know when you just want to make a little cake. <laughs> so, um, I got this one. They did have the yellow cake and the white cake as well from Duncan Hines. Um, but yeah, I went with chocolate and that is this haul. I'm gonna close out this video now because this should be a long enough video. I'm sorry about the lighting again. Ugh, can never get it right. But thank you so much for watching and give it a thumbs up. We'll see you guys on the next one, bye.